next steps in creating the three view drawing will be to switch to the construction layer and to use a series of construction lines to create both the top view of the doorstop as well as the right side. I will be creating both at once to show you all the steps and because many of them match. First thing I'm going to do is switch to the construction layer. All of my lines should end up yellow and following a pattern, not solid. Second thing I'm going to do is drop the draw menu down and find the construction line tool. From now on, I'm going to actually use XL on the keyboard to start this command. I'm going to start out by placing vertical, which I can click on the command bar to select, or have typed the letter V and then enter to select vertical lines. These are going to be infinitely long vertical lines. I am going to place them all of the corners that I will see in my top view. My top view will show me the beginning and end of the width, as well as the location of where my flat part changes to an angle. I'm going to hit escape to stop the tool. Again, this time I'm going to use the shortcut keys of XL, enter, the shortcut key of H, make this horizontal. I'm going to drop them at the top and the bottom of my shape. I'm going to now hit escape. One of the rules that we talked about is all of our views need to be equally spaced. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to use the offset tool. I'm going to set offset to two and a half inches. And go from the top line up and the rightmost line over. That created my gaps between my front and my right side view and my front and my top view. I'm going to hit escape to stop that command. I'm now going to go to offset again. This time I'm going to put in the depth of the item. Depth of the item in this case was 1.5 or 1.5. Enter. And the bottom of the top view line right here goes up 1.5 and, and this goes over. I keep building these construction lines away from the front view, not back towards it. At this point I have now outlined my top view, as well as my right side. I am going to go to my visible layer and now trace them. I will knock out the right side first because it's the easiest. I'm going to get the rectangle tool, start at an intersection, go to the opposite corner of an intersection to create that square that is the right side. I'm going to start the rectangle tool a second time, go from the very bottom left, to top right, and then get the line tool to draw in, again, where the flat view transitions to the angle. If I want to see my handiwork while I am not on the construction layer, I'm on the visible layer, I can click this menu and click the construction layer off. You see that I now have the right side and the top view created. They are aligned and they are equally spaced.